Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with another Fate Grand Order video. I'm joined with my brother, Nux. Hello! And we're back for more challenge quests. We have not learned our lesson. We are still trying to get a second win! <laughs> we're still trying to go for that illustrious second win. We're trying to go for that second win. So here's the, here's the caveat that we got. We're trying to do every challenge quest, at least one. I'm not doing this one because this is literally just this one, but harder. Uh, we got one shot, we got one chance, the teams are chosen in, in a style between I choose one, then my brother chooses one, then I choose another, and that's the basic go of it. So far, we've only ever been able to beat one, and that is Leonidas with the 300, and we have lost every other single one of them. Some of them, I feel like we would have gotten it if we had gotten the second try, but we just don't have the time for the we second try. We don't have try. the second try. We don't have time for the second try. But we're here to fight the grand finale of the Golden Metropolis. That's right. It's Gil time. It's Gil Caster. Gil Caster. So let's go in here, find my brother's support, and see what he's got for us this time. I've got a lot for you this time. All right, there let's see. There he is. For the weenies, damn, full full squad. We got the full squad. I'm All right. You pick. All right, let's see. We've got uh, Melt with the weenie. We got uh, Gills the Ray of Saber back here with Orion. With Orion, we got Tota celebrating his victory over us with a skull. We've got um, Canis. Canis, thank you. I'm trying to always remember how to say the name correctly. Canis also holding some chocolate. That's that's glasses. Is it glasses? I thought Kentucky's it was chocolate. glasses. Oh, it's Kentucky's glasses. That's pretty funny. We got Ryder Da Vinci holding the 200 percenter. We got Gills Caster now looking serious because he knows it's serious time. He had a different Final form. Yeah, he had a different face last time we saw him, but now he's locked in. He's locked in fully. And he's, he's locked in fully. We've got um, Steno. Steno up in Assassin holding the BB slot. We got Bunyan in her bunny outfit holding the 100% kaleidoscope. And we have Oberon holding the BB. Uh, I had to get her on there somehow. <laughs> fair. <laughs> Try and add BB somewhere in there. All right, let's see who we got here. The, besides Melt, who is technically BB. Yeah, yeah, who is a form of BB. Uh, I feel like Oberon would be a, probably be a good pick here, but I'm gonna have to go for once again the 200 percenter and go for Da Vinci over here. So let's see what this got. What we got here? Defeated enemy servants will use both buffs and debuffs, so try to be defeat them in the most advantageous order possible. Oh God! The Bride of Babylon will buff an enemy servant that shows up after her. King Gold will fully uh, restore HP for all enemies and allies when he is defeated. If your party is running low on HP, defeat them. Defeat him. Defeating him could turn the tide for you. Hmm. Wait a minute. So restore for all allies when all he is defeated. All allies and enemies, yeah. Okay, so that means if we kill him, yeah. he heals us as well. Okay. King Gold. Let's clear all. Light the slate clean. Light the slate clean. So obviously they mentioned the bride, so that means Saber Nero is up in the mix. The bride of Babylon? See. Yeah, the bride of Babylon makes it feel like it's going to be her. So let me look at my archers. Why well, would it be her, though? Who else would it be? Who else is the bride of Babylon, boy? The whore of Babylon. Exactly. Tiamat's coming back. <laughs> right here. I'm going to go with uh, Saber Summer. Saber Summer with your 100... Uh, let's go next. Let's go. Uh, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Uh, I'm thinking. Uh, Orion. You gonna go Orion double? Yeah. All right. Go here. Just so we have a big dude. We do have a big dude. Okay. So now we're gonna have to. We're gonna be eating light now because of that. So I think I'm gonna go double dip back into the casters. I'm gonna bring out everyone's favorite supporter. Martha. Martha. Shit! I almost started the fight. Okay. Who do you want to go? Uh, who do I want? Uh, that's a good question. Let's see. She works oh, as Clapius. I will mention that it's likely going to be more style of fights, but you know what? Ask Clapius. Then we're going to go in Mash here for the final. Mash has been here with us the entire time. No. Almost. <laughs> To be fair, the one time she wasn't there, it was the worst experience in the, the world. It was the worst. It was the quickest. It was the quickest of all of them. Okay, let's go in there. Toon Squad. Toon Squad's final stand on the Gilgamesh side. Yes. The final side. And then we go the to ben the next. Yes. Which we had to record on a different day because this took us way longer than I thought. You thought this wasn't going to be long? No, I thought that we would go a little bit faster, but then I forgot that there was going to be a 300 Spartan fight at one point. There's going to be a bunch of stalling. Yeah. 
I mean, again, it's really a shame that I just got really busy and the week that I wanted to do it, and there was just oh, nothing right. I could do. Yeah, I was right. Do you want to build a city? <gasps> but all of them are... Only no break bar. No break bar. So seven servants. Okay, let's see. So we can obviously start mm -hmm. with... And when they break, they use everything. Yeah, so let's see. Flower of the stadium. Increase all allies MP damage resistance when all allies, excluding yours, reaches zero. Activate Rose's Encore. Maximize the bread's MP charge and increase MP strength when you're on the field. Activate on exit. Apply guts. When HP reaches zero, apply guts to all allies. So we really don't want to use. We want to keep her alive for as long as possible. Yeah. But also, the flower of the stadium increases all allies' MP damage resistance, but that means if we don't kill her, we our MPs do nothing. Well, to be fair, there's one dude with an MP that does nothing. <laughs> On here? Yeah, Orion. I mean, yes. Okay, maybe the, the Orion carry will have to happen. We have to get rid of Bunyan, I think. Uh, apply nullify attack buff to all enemies when you are on the field. When HP reaches zero, remove all enemies' defensive buffs, and then recover HP at the end of each turn. Alright. So we should wait for the defensive buffs after she's gone. Yeah. So I can at least heal for now. Heal? Not heal. I'll give the attack up. Um, Golden body. Yeah, for the... For that. Okay, we'll go here. I think we'll go... Saber. Saber. Slap him with some water. Drink it up. Drink it up. Slap, slap, slap. Okay, this is we gonna hurt. Check the young outlaw king. We did not check. Applies ignore defense to all enemies when you are on the field. Ooh, that's pretty bad. When HP reaches zero, apply sure hit permanent to all enemies. We don't really care about that, so I think he can probably be next to go, honestly. Inflict burn to a single enemy during your normal attack. That's also pretty bad. Okay. So what's good here is that I think Orion can kill someone here. I think you're correct. Let me do a quick little heal. And then I think I don't need to do anything for here. Because that increases defense. Uh, he has zero defensive buffs besides guts, so we just don't use the guts. Not yet. I mean, we can't use the guts. Because he already has guts. Yeah. There would be no point. So we can go here, and then we can use this, and I think we can kill Bunyan. Yeah. Damn it! <laughs> Why did none of that apply? You missed. You can miss? I guess you missed. How? I don't know any explanation other than someone has something on the field that makes you miss. Uh, I didn't, unless they hit me with something, I wouldn't have known. Okay, well, I'll go here, here, here. I think that will work out. Yeah. That should be enough to kill with a single crit. Yeah, I was correct. Thankfully. Oh, so whenever anyone dies, she gets her NP. Yes. That's pretty bad. It is AoE. No, it's not. Single target. Oh, is she not the AOE one? No. Bright is single target. Okay, single target. But this is going to deal enough damage. If this just hits, um... I mean, that's fine. He has a Guts. And he lived. No, he did not. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, she didn't shifts target? into the... Because usually they don't show if you get debuffed or not after you die. Because if you die, you don't get any of that. And really? I figured... Oh. That means we, we need to heal him because otherwise he dies to the fire. Yes. So we need to... I mean, we have to kill we him. We have to kill him regardless. Yeah, we have to kill him now. And then most likely Nero. Do we have to go here, here? Just to... Yeah. Yeah, okay. She's going to hit us with another noble phantasm. Yeah. I'm going to hope it is. Nope. Are you kidding me? It was not enough? He didn't die. He healed, but that doesn't matter because this is a this single target. Is about to hit everyone. Isn't it a Wii? No. Okay, I was gonna say that's the best one they could probably hit. Yeah. Cause she has a. Uh... But they're all gonna get sure hit next turn. You know that. Sure are. <laughs> so I can probably just hold off on actually killing them. What does we are pirates do? That's a good. Well, we are pirates. Apply as HP gets lower. Attack increase to all enemies when they're on the field. When HP reaches zero, decrease the defense and decrease HP whoever defeated you. 
increase crit. I think what we need to do is take out Da Vinci and bring in someone to give him that final push, which would be uh, Santa Martha. Or Mash. Or Mash. Either one of them is fine with me. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go with Santa Martha, because she is up next anyway. Okay. A little bit of heal. Then it heals a little bit, and that's fine. And this can MP seal. Yeah, hey, I forgot it applies to all of them. God, Santa Martha is so crazy. Uh, we already have it up, but you can give them more crit stars. It's true, I can. Just... Shit, I forgot. It's fine. Uh, we'll go Artemis here. Do we actually want to go here and then use this and then go for the final buster on Nero? Yeah. That's good. Mm. But she can't hit us with the Noble Phantasm. I'm ricocheting. I'm ricocheting. Lend me your power, Artemis. This is a Castoria built fight. This is. It's alright. One crit win. <laughs> one crit win. Now everyone has guts, unfortunately. Three, yeah, three guts, but honestly, it's fine. We just need to be smarter, and there it goes. We traded blow for blow on that one, basically. Two for one. Oh, that's not good. It's about to be another one, though. Uh, that's not good for a lot of reasons. I'll use this now. Just for the hell of it. I'll use this to increase, and then... Because Da Vinci dies here anyway. Fight up the assassin a little bit. I could, I should read up what the assassin and the other ones do, honestly. He's probably going to turn into the other one. Applies invincibility. Oh, he has guts. We won't know. Session. Okay, he needs to die. It's Clapius. Uh, before your noble phantasm is activated and when you are on the field, add one charge to all allies until the end of the turn. God damn. That is, uh, bad. Shouldn't have activated on him, but it's fine. Heal Martha. Go here. Get a little heal. Go here. Try and fight him down. But honestly, I don't know. Let's see what happens when he turns into Mr. Hyde. I don't think it's going to be enough to drop him down, that's the problem. Yeah. The most we can do is, like, stop him from turning into Mr. Hyde. But we're also going to get hit by, like, 5,000 NPs on my turn, so... Yep. Um... Yeah, and because that's a Lancer on there, we have no follow-up at all. I don't even know if this will kill him. Because the guts will activate. Three times. Yeah, it's over. That crit was funny, but unfortunately that crit is what sealed us in. There's just no way for us to fight this back. This really is built for Castoria. <laughs> or uh, Castoria or Merlin. Merlin, because it was his era. Yeah. Alright, I'm leaving it to you. Let's go for you. That seems. Uh, I'm just getting hit with uh, multiple NPs at this point. Big gun. <laughs> the only good thing here is that Hyde has no actual NP. No, it seems like once he's in there, he's in there. But now he has a new effect. After normal phantasm is used, and when your HP reaches zero, decrease all enemies' attack. I mean, that is worse than what he had previously, so it's fine. Uh, but still not good. Especially because this looks like this just doesn't disappear unless I hit her. So I have to, no, yeah, I have to hit her. And he healed after that guts, too. He healed full. Yeah. Because he turned into Hyde. Yeah, I mean, that's not the, the tricky thing about these kill in specific order type of deal fights. Yeah. Uh, it's over. So I'm just gonna go for hide. Kill Mr. Hide. 
I'm gonna try. He doesn't deserve his life. <laughs> Oh no. You hit him with a charm. And he stunned him? Is it, isn't that he, enough? Did you not have enough? He says, not only is he charmed by this little girl, you're stunned by these pirates. Damn. I forgot that it just targets everything. I'm gonna cook up a delicious meal and end it. And end my life. Fighting Hyde. Fighting Mr. Hyde. You have to make your own progress now, saying that at least if Hyde dies, we'll, we're fine. I mean, we'll never get back the fact that Nero got, like, low diffed by... Uh, or one tap. Yeah, by getting hit. We didn't even... Uh, I didn't think she was going to die, so... I thought she was going to die. <laughs> I thought if he got the crit, she was going to die, but I didn't think that he was going to actually hit the crit. I was preparing it for next turn. No. He yeah. said, I need to kill her now. I'm doing this now. There he goes. Kill him. Please. One. He got all three of them back. Let's go. Tack down, baby. Mr. Hyde is down. Here comes Mr. Gold. Is it really the last of them? Yeah. Oh, well, at least we made it to the end of the fight. We did. Luckily. All right. Take us out. Time for stall. Yeah, we're gonna st the famous stall team of Asaclapius and Mashu. I've seen it happen. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> no effect. Because it adds, it gives a, a guts, correct? Yeah. Yeah, that's not happening here. If only you could stack guts. Ooh. I know, it's so sad you can't. They said actually this ability. This only to, works on uh, the enemies, actually. <laughs> they can only stack double guts. Yeah, apparently the only a very select units can give it, and Nero is known as one of them, and therefore when you fight her fight, she gives it to everyone. I mean, it's still not as bad as the Nero with the infinite guts that one year. You mean the, the on-release Nero with infinite guts? Yeah, when you if you kill her and don't save her for last, then she just gives everyone infinite guts, and it's impossible to actually to finish the fight. Yes. Oh. Mash takes it in the face. Not again. Refuses to die. No. No. Give him a match with the last tap. Battle over. Damn. It's all Jover. It's all Jover for me. For the everyone. One. For, for the ones I care about. For my cat who's licking his leg. He's currently licking his leg. Or Orion's big ass body covering the entire screen. <laughs> Castoria. Uh, that's not Castoria. Artoria's bomb in the view. Okay, that's better. That's okay. That's okay. I don't want to see any of y'all. I don't want to see any of you. You <laughs> failed. Everyone Except failed. For Mash and Except for Mash. Except for uh, Mash was a technically a part of a team that did not fail. So what have we learned here? Uh, Oberon really fucking good. Because he's the one who actually got us the win in. <laughs> for this one. Because that ability to give a steroid came in clutch and saving him for the end. Uh, so we're one in we're one in six now. Let me we see. still need one more, but the other side, that's when we get it. Okay, so, and also a reminder, this is the easy one. That was the easy one. This is next. Don't worry, we handle these. You know why? So we'll be going against... Think about the last time you've heard of Mestopheles doing something. It's true, but some of these other ones... Okay, but I'm really scared of that one and the last one, because they put Romulus and that was before Quintarius. It's true. Uh, so we'll be back for some more. I think all these videos are releasing in quick succession, so... Because it's so much. It is so much in so it's little time. And I'm also content. I'm also running out of, of this video space on my computer, so I have to just release these. So there's just gonna be, like, a... I, I go from, like, re releasing, like, a three videos a week to suddenly releasing... Two a day. Three a day, I think. Three a day? I think it has to be three a day, because I have to also still record other videos. Which are videos that they will already hear and talk about, because I have to talk about Sea Monster Crisis, because they decided to fucking release it on the 28th. And I have to talk about what's going up next month. It's a lot of stuff. It's a lot of stuff. So join us for more stuff. Seven more, at least seven more videos. I am saying we're gonna, we have to get at least one more win. We have to. We have to figure Even out Even if something. we have to force it. Even if we have to somehow force it. Okay. All right. We'll be back, everyone. Goodbye. Say goodbye, boy. Rolling? Yeah, roll. You got a five. That means critical win. Critical win.
Well, it's 15. <laughs> Damn, I forgot that uh, Mike Sad was not underneath uh -huh. it. There he is. All right, bye. Mike.